So what spirit of- Oh my goodness! <laughs> okay! Um... Well now that is... That is quite problematic. Hey folks, we're back in it. Uh, with this, you know, piece of meat. Here. Doing more of Return of the Obra Ten. My name's Chris. You can call me Spartacris if you like. If you don't like, don't do it. <laughs> oh. Oh, snap. What is going on here? This guy's getting shot by... Somebody here. Whoever this guy... I'm not sure who that guy is. Oh, it looks like he's trying to kidnap her. Um, another like gunner dude shoots this dude. I'm not sure who he is. What else is going on? Someone else is down. He's on the ground. He's injured. Oh, that dude is bound. Oh, I wonder if he's the guy that they hung in the photo? Okay. Now, who's this? Oh, dang. Come on. I need to do my, uh, my searching round. All right. Murder. There's been a murder, and who is to blame? Was it Colonel Mustard? It better not be. Okay, who is this? That we don't know, but they were shot. With a gun. By, um, I don't know that we... Yeah, we don't have his identity yet. Just starting to see who who all was there and if any of them we could identify yet. Doesn't look like it. So I think that was the guy it looked like they hung. They hung this guy. Um Or did they? Was that the body I saw? Or was it this dude? I don't know. I'm going to have to look again. Okay, who's this guy? This is the helmsman, right? Yep, that's the helmsman. Um, This was... That young guy... That was Lars Lind. Um... The body that's hanging. I just want to double check. Is. Okay. That guy. So I'm wondering. If that is. Whoever that is. That's him. Also. I bet it is, because then there's the royalty again right here. It looks like that's these two are right here. And I bet that guy, I bet that's the back of his head. Looking at his clothes, so looking at the boots, the pants... Um, what we can see from the shirt, looks like there's a dark vest and then there's the white sleeves. I think they hung this guy or something or, oh, no, they didn't hung him. Okay, so they, they, they put him up there. Okay, and then they kill him by firing squad. Interesting. Okay. So what happened here?
Why is this guy trying to, like, kidnap this lady? And who... Who's watching? Uh, a steward. It's definitely a steward. Do we... No, we don't have his name. Whoever he is, he is probably that... That guy's steward. Because this is an officer. Okay, so this guy. I think that was not him. This guy. So we we get this guy, and then we'll figure out this guy. Okay. Uh, where's it taking us? Oh, okay. So it's going to take us to the, uh, the dude that's strapped up. All right. Let's solve this mystery. Let's do it. What did that little string of meat have to do with that whole scene, by the way? <laughs> I don't understand that. That's weird. At first I was thinking morbid, like, what if that's what was left of the dude that was hanging there? But he's over here, and that meat particle was over there. So I have no idea what that had to do with anything. If anything at all. So, it is what it is, I guess. Oh. Nuncio Pasqua. Oh. As captain of this ship, and by the authority of the East India Company, and thus the Crown of England, I sentence you to death by firing line. Okay. Mr. Wolf, when you are ready. Mr. Wolf, when you're ready. Ready, men. In. Fire. Wow, this is going to give us a ton of stuff. Okay, whose bullet actually hit him? This trail here. This guy. Brennan. Brennan's bolt's the one that actually strikes him. Everyone else is missed. Okay, who's Wolf? This guy is Wolf. Oh boy. We're gonna get so much here. Okay, so... Wolf. Whose last name is Wolf? Christian Wolf. Gunner. Okay. Um. And his name was Hawk Sing Lao, I think they said. And they said he killed this guy. These are the Formosians. Formosa. Hak Seng Lan. Okay. So we know that's him. And they said... Someone said Miss Lim, so that's got to be her. Bun Lan Lim. Okay. That's interesting. So what else do we got here? I wonder if there's anything else we can figure out while we're here. Okay, I've got a, there's a lot of stuff I need to This is a memory that I need to spend a lot of time in. I think we're going to be able to figure out even more than we just did. Okay, he was shot. Um shot with a gun and it was Brennan that killed him. Brennan's on the last page, I remember. Yes. Yes. Okay. What all can we figure out? Okay, here's another of the Formosians. These two. Who are you? 
Okay. So he's trying to talk to them. Do we know who he is? Wei Li. Okay, he's a topman. We don't know what happened to him. Oh, this is the sketch itself. This is the sketch. Interesting. Um, this... Oh, this is the guy. We don't know who he is, but we were suspecting he's the French guy. I wonder if this is... Um, what did they say? Nuncio? Let's see what we have back here. Oh! Okay, they have some cooking utensils. Um... Is that a monkey on top of this goat? What's the monkey gonna do to the goat? What are you doing, little guy? Get down from there. You're gonna hurt yourself. He's wearing an apron. He's got some cooking utensils. I bet that they are cooks. Probably like a cook, and then if the cook has a steward or something. Um... Or like an assistant cook. Oh, there's a cook and a butcher. I would assume he's probably the cook. And he's probably the butcher then if he's got... Well, I don't know. He's got an apron. But the fact that he's got the little, like, spit thing, that makes me think he's the cook. And that might be the butcher. Um, we'll find out, though. Uh, okay, that's the sketch artist. Who's this guy? I don't know what he's doing. Okay, that's a steward. I think he was on that boat that escaped. That we were looking at before. But we still don't know who he is. Okay, he's definitely... Wait a minute. Okay, he was just... He was clubbed by Brennan. Definitely this guy's steward. So we find his identity. We find this kid's identity. Okay, can we learn anything about you, sir? Don't know about you. Um, he's wearing overalls, it looks like. Some sort of worker, maybe a sailor. Just a sailor. Uh, that's Lind again. Yeah. Uh, okay, he's the bosun. These must be two more top men. Yeah. They look like they might be... of some kind of, like, Asian descent. How many... I wonder how many are from China. Because we've also got this guy who definitely is from China. And I think, looks like he probably speaks their language and he was trying to calm them down. So let's, uh, let's take a look. Um. Oh, yeah, there's quite a few. There's four of them. Uh, Huang Li, uh, Chi Zong, uh, how, how, do I, how do you say that? Is it still, I don't think it's still a J sound in Chinese. Because the Z-H is J, a J. So maybe it's Xi, like Xi Jiang, Li Hong, Li Lei. Okay. Um, who do we have? Who are these guys? So, we've got 
These four guys. Are these... Is there just a gunner thing? Or just all... Okay, I guess they'll just be semen. <laughs> uh, there's not very many midshipmen. Yeah, it's not them. As far as you guys go... We've got you already, right? I think I looked... Yeah. You... You are the one that we're still trying to figure out. You we've got... And you... We know how you die, but that's it, so... Okay, we'll figure out this guy next. Cool. I, I'm assuming this is the Nunzio guy, but we'll see. That, that this guy's accused of killing. All right, let's see what we got. Dun dun. Hello. Who is there? Hmm. Who is that? Is someone hurt? Senor Nichols, is that you? Senor Nichols, he says. Oh. Watch your step. Here, let me help you. Oh, Jesus. Okay. So that guy, Nick Nichols, this guy definitely, he's got some kind of accent. It sounded like. Italian, maybe? Oh, there's the- Oh, he's knocked out. What is this? It's like a shiny shell of some kind. Oh, he killed the guy, and then he framed the Formosian guy. He framed him. Oh, and this is the guy that, um, he was also trying to, um, kidnap the other Formosian, um, the, the woman. Interesting. Okay. So he was killed by, okay, so this is the Nunzio guy. Nunzio Pasqua. Okay, so that's got to be him. And he was... I didn't see what actually got him, if it was a knife or a sword. Um, let me get back in there and take a look a little bit better. Um... Hmm... Well, you can't really tell. We'll say knife. We'll go with a knife. Knifed by... Oh, he's the second... Mi <gasps> okay, this is going to open up so much stuff now. So if that was Nichols... Oh, please tell me I got this right now. Yes! Okay. I'm gonna be able to identify a bunch of people now that we got that. Okay, what's the third one? Ah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, so... Here's the thing, though. 
we do some like process of elimination stuff, we can identify some more folks. Um, so Nichols, um, his steward was this guy. So now we can identify him. If Nichols is the second mate, then whoever is the second mate's steward. Uh, Samuel Galligan, so that's him. Um Okay, we gotta we gotta set him as Nichols. Yeah. Okay, so now we have the captain, third mate, second mate, which makes this guy the fourth mate, and him the fourth mate steward. Because I don't think that's going to be a mate. So I think I know. Appears to be blurred. Don't have sufficient information to determine their identity. I think I got it. Carry on and pay attention. Faces will become unblurred. Yeah, I know, I know. I think I I think I've got it though. I want to try. I think that's gotta be John Davies. And that makes him the fourth mate steward. Um Davy James. Okay. So what officer have we not identified? So we've got the gunner. We've got the bosun. We've got all the mates and the captain. So now I think that means we can identify this guy. Um, who have we not gotten? We've got these officers. Um, we don't have Charles Minor yet. I don't know if a purse, I don't know if a purser is a, uh, I don't know if a purser is a thing, like a officer kind of thing. Hmm. But he's up there with a lot of the do I don't know. Okay, Scotland. There might be a way to figure that to figure it out. If we find a if we go back to a memory he was in and revisit it, we might be able to figure out if he's Scottish. If he is, then I think that's who it is. Um, let's check some of these others. Anyone else been revealed yet that we haven't tried? Process of elimination, these are going to be one of two people. Um... I have a hunch that maybe this is his brother, because we know he's got a brother, but... Not sure who that guy is yet. Okay. I don't know. I think that's, that's as far as we're going to get for now. Um... I wonder if we can revisit that one. Um, I'm trying to think of a, where to find the memory that that one guy was in that we might hear his voice. 
Hmm. There would have been some stuff below deck. Um... It was one of the... Um, okay, it wasn't this deck. It was... A deck even farther down. I believe. No, it was this deck. It was this deck. Okay, so... Um... One of these... Which one? Well, that's his corpse. So let's see. That being his corpse, let's let's try him. Let's see if we can hear his t him talk. Okay. It's so quiet. I can't tell. He could have been... He could have been Scottish, Irish, English. Uh, I could tell there's an accent, but I couldn't tell what it was. <sighs> Dang. Alright. Nah, we're gonna have to let him go for now. Alright, let's, um... Let's just keep doing some exploring... Um, okay, we, we did that. I guess that's where we left off. Oops. Come on. Open the door. Yeah, open it. Okay, nothing. I don't remember if we had looked in all these rooms yet. I think we have. Yeah, these look familiar. I know we looked through these four. Uh, we did all that side. Okay. This bottom deck is opened up now, so we definitely haven't been down here. Wow! Uh. Alright, someone definitely made a mess down here, huh? Oh, okay. Some blood. Well, I guess we'll follow that blood trail in a minute. Ooh, I don't... <laughs> uh, the long hallways are kind of creeping me out. Definitely a blood trail. Nope, I see flies down there. Look through all these little windows. Oh, there's something over there, too. Like a, I don't know what that is. Like, it almost looks like part of a torso. Hung up like a rotten torso. Yeesh. Yeesh, dude. Well. This guy's had a rough day. What is this? With the wall. Oh. Alright. Let's give it a shot. Oh, God. Jeez. He got speared. What's this guy? Oh, we don't know who he is yet, though. Wait, who... He looks like he's kind of dressed like another steward. Is there a steward we haven't identified? One, two, three. No. 
first, second, third, fourth. But he's dressed kind of like one. I wonder. Mm, I don't know. We'll figure it out. So what spirit of... Oh, my goodness. <laughs> okay. Um. Well, now that is... That is quite problematic. That is a big old... I... I don't know. Spider crab monster. I guess. Well, I don't like that one bit. Um, we're going to have... To, oh. Well, there's some spikes there, too. We're going to need to get a... Oh, we can't get in there for a better look. Who's hiding? That guy's hiding. All right. Oh, my gosh. Well, this guy got speared by something. <laughs> I don't know what. Now, it, this makes it look like we should be able to identify him, and I don't... Hmm. Unless he could be the bosun's mate... Maybe. I don't know. I don't like it. Uh, he would look a little more prestigious. Unknown steward. Ship steward. Nah. Well, yeah. That actually makes... That actually makes sense. Because he is dressed like another steward. I bet that's who this guy is. Okay. I honestly bet that's who he is. He's dressed like a steward. Um, okay. He was speared by, um, a beastie. Okay. Now, what are you doing? Who are you again? Well, we don't know who you are just yet, but it looks like we should be able to figure out who you are. Are you going to let us... How do we get out of here? Oh, there's a dead guy here. Hmm. Lead me, Spice Ghost. Lead me. You coming? Okay. Let's let's go. Don't dilly dally, sir. Alright. Well, I'm pretty sure this guy just got spiked to death from what it looked like or speared. I've got you. Don't move. I'll get you down. Hmm. I'm talking to him. Oh. That's the guy I thought might be either the cook or butcher. Who's talking to him? Okay, I don't know who that guy is yet. Oh my gosh, there's so much going on here. Okay, there's someone dead there. There's a knife in that spider guy. Um, he's dumping maybe water or oil. I bet oil. Hitting him something. Okay, that's that guy. What's this guy up to? He's just kneeling with a sword. Okay. Well, it looked like, looked like he was... Speared, spiked. It looked kind of like spikes. 
like it looked like there's multiple things. I don't I didn't mean to do that, but I think he was spiked. Yeah, that works. That satisfies me. Yeah, there's multiple things in there. Now somebody's in that room and I really wanna Or were they not in there just yet? Yeah. So I guess he's hiding. Hmm. And it's saying that we can identify him. So what else is in this room? I can't tell what this room is. It's around like an ascot. I'm not sure if that says anything. Oh, here's this guy. Before he dies. Oh, this looks like he's already hurt. He was already hurt before the spike came through. So I wonder what happened to him. Um, alright, let's check everything out. Um... So this was, again, this is, uh, Nathan Peters. Okay, we can't look up there. He's dumping what looks like oil, and they're gonna light it on fire, it looks like. Now this guy, who are you? Don't know who you were. You got knifed by someone, and we don't know who it was. Great. Alright, um... Okay, we're gonna figure out who this guy is, how he died. Let's do this. I just, uh, I spilled water on myself, friends. I'm all watery now, I'm all wet. And not like the, uh, the, you know, after a dinner kind. That sucks. Like the, I'm a child and I can't use regular drinkware kind. Okay. Uh. Hey, bud. Denton. Well, that sounds pretty bad. Okay. Oh. Oh. Whoa, bud. You look like you're on fire, sir. Are you also being stabbed? Or is... Oh, no. Um, that thing's being stabbed. Um... Oh, no, he did get stabbed by something. Um... Is it a spike or... S yeah, there's a spike on him. And then he burned... Yeah, we're gonna have to look at everything else going on, too. Alright, he had been spiked. Um, what happened to you? You're still there. Oh, I don't think he got spiked. I, or, speared. I think he got spiked. Or at least he initially got spiked, and then he got speared, and that might have just finished him off. So I might actually stand by it. How did they die? I'm gonna go with burned. I mean, he got spiked, but no one's gonna survive being lit on fire like that. Okay, what else do we have going on? Um, I don't know who these folks are. Yeah, it's... You know, I didn't even think to look through those windows yet. Anything else I can see? Is this guy already in here? Yep. He's just like, what is going on out there? Hmm. We will investigate every inch. Alright, we just gotta get out there and look it in the face. 
Actually, you know what? Let's, uh, let's look through these windows. See if there's anything else for us to see. Those look like books of some kind. Huh. Those are blocked, those are blocked, those are blocked. Oh, is that a... is that a skull? Like a cow skull or something. Okay. Mm. Yeah, we've seen what you guys are up to. This guy looks like he's maybe already injured. But he ain't dying yet. Um, okay, that's our bosun. Now we got two dead over here. Oh, their heads are off. That's fun. Okay, and uh, what we got here? This dude. And... I wonder if there's another creature coming. That's what they're... Preparing for. Um, alright. Is there anything else that we can see? Doesn't look like it. Okay. I think we're ready to move. All right, we'll get to see how these guys went. Um, obviously decapitated. That's not going to be rocket science. I guess I can leave my rocket science degree at home for that part. Da -da. Cool. Oh, God. We're no use. Oh. Yeah. Oh, it was one of these. Yeah. Oh, wait. It's not a crab thing. It's something riding on the crab thing. Holy crap. Well, that's quite different. Hmm. This guy's throwing some fire. I might need to revisit their... Oh, and somebody here got spiked. Oh, that's that guy. So he had already... That's right. He had already been hit. Okay, there's still a lot for me to look at. I can... I think we can easily say decapitated for those two. No idea who they are, but we can say decapitated by a beast. A beastie. Yep. And decapitated by a beastie beast. Le beast. All right. What else can we determine? Oh, what happened, sir? Who are you? Okay. Oh, that's the guy that we saw earlier and it looked like he was injured and we didn't know why. Okay, here's that guy. Okay, we're going to get to explore up there a little bit too. That's going to be good. Uh, who's this? This guy. Looks like he was coming from below deck. Uh, throwing something to that guy. Oh, no, that guy's giving him a gun. Mm. 
Okay, okay. So that's when he first got stabbed, started climbing through there. Understood that part. Uh, we can't get back far enough to see the guy hiding. They've kind of started taking that stuff over. Oh, no, there's somebody there who's... <laughs> okay, that guy's hiding back there. Um, other details can we possibly notice? Looks to be about it for down here, but there's definitely stuff going on up here. Quite a bit, too. Goodness gracious. All right. Uh, this guy... Okay, he was one of the other ship dudes, or officers. Let's creepy creep. Who's this guy? <gasps> oh, we saw him with a sword, uh, earlier. Or, um, not him. We saw a sword... In another, um, there was another, um, so I, you can't see, I'm like holding my head right now. There's a memory earlier, and there was a sword hanging next to a bunk. I remember that. So it belongs to him, and now I'm trying to think of who he was. I'm trying to remember the number. It was a 50-something, I think. I just want to see if I can jog my memory. Uh, I think it was in the 50s. And he's got... So he's wearing a turban. So I think some, like, Middle Eastern... For sure. Oh, man, but everybody here is from India. Um... Yeah, that sure is... Heck, doesn't narrow it, narrow it down at all. All right, so that's not going to help. Okay, let's see what else we can find. This guy, I'm guessing we're going to do him, like his thing, in a minute. Whatever this guy is, he got spiked hard. Um, This guy looks like he's been spiked or stabbed. Nathan Peters. Anything else that we can suss out? Not yet. Okay. Okay, so we are going to look at that guy next. That's a good lead, though. That's cool. I wish, uh, I just wish I could remember what memory that would be. I know it was an early one, but I have no idea which one it was or like how we would find it. Hmm. All right, bud. How'd you die? Tell me. Oh, and Damon. What's going on? Stay back. It's already done for Nick. It's already done for Nick. Come on, boss. No, get there. Hey! Well, he got spiked, that's for sure. Okay, and he's about to get spiked. N. Damon. What is it? N. Damon. Oh, he's got a sword too. Oh, but that's not like the sword. N. Damon.
I wonder who said that and if that will tell me. I'm gonna look up that with that spelling and see if that'll tell me anything. And Damon. Not in Demon Google. God. It's like Greek or Latin? I don't know. Doesn't sound right. Well, he was spiked. Yeah. Um, oh crap. I didn't mean to close that all the way, though. Um. Oh, poop. I goofed it, friends. Dang it. Uh, I didn't mean to move on yet. All right, we're going to have to backtrack in a minute. Right. Okay, we'll go up there, we'll see where Spice Ghost takes us, and then we're gonna backtrack. I need to look in that memory again. Yo! Quit swirling around and get to the point. Because <laughs> there's a lot of stuff there that still requires some looking into. I need to see the transcript. Yep. What's going on? Somebody back. It's all right now. Hey. Come on, boss. No. Get there. Hey. Oh, did you hear that? Kaka ka ka ka. Sound like somebody from um freaking um Street Fighter. Uh, 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 uh. And Damon, a demon. Okay, it wasn't him. Somebody else said, and Damon. And the way he said, what's going on? Okay, well, since he wasn't the one that said it, that's not going to help. But he said it's already done for Nick. So we need to see... Who is already down or dead? He's not injured. That might be this Nick person. None of them are injured. Could this be Nick? Or could this be Nick? Nah, I... I Y'all yeah, got a sneaking suspicion this ain't Nick. <laughs> Yikes, dude. Oh, look at its eyes! Oh my goodness. Creepy. Oh, boy. Um... Okay, so this has to be someone named Nick. Let's look for someone named... Probably Nicholas. And they're probably either a Topman or a Seaman. <laughs> uh, there we go. Nicholas Botter Botteril. Topman. Boom. There we are, friends. You poor man. We'll get him soon. Okay. Um. Let's get back up there. And check out poor Nick. Where's he at? Over here? All right, Nick, what do you got for me? Oh, 
Oh, man. Well, yeah. Okay, so it wasn't the beast that got him. It was the dude on the beast speared him. So what else is going on around here? Got all these guys up here. Jeez. People up in the sails, maybe? Oh! Here, <laughs> here's this guy. How are we gonna do- Maybe he fell to his death? Why would this dude fall? Maybe he passed out like he saw those dudes and he's like, ah! Thunk. Alright, well. His fate is not unknown. Okay, he's on, um, on, uh, blurred now. So he was speared, and we're gonna say by an enemy. Yeah. Okay. Oh, we're doing this guy now. Okay. This is interesting. I, I do want to know, like, how, how, sir. <laughs> well, shouldn't have to move very far because uh, that's where he lands. Show me. Show me, ghost. Give me your spice. Give me your spice. There you are. Yes. Yes. Da -da. Take me through your memories. Whoa! Uh... Okay. Uh... Braga struck by lightning. Holy crap. Oh, look at this. There's a whole bunch of folks up here. These are all the top men, I bet. I don't know if this might help us identify a few. Who's this guy? Is that the sword guy? He's wearing a turban. Maba. Okay, this, this might help us out. This might help us out a little bit. Being able to see everybody that could be a topman might help us out here. Who is this and how did they die? Well, they were definitely electrocuted. Uh, okay. Okay, but I want to try and get a really good look. Yeah, everyone else, that over there. Oh, that was the one dude that was climbing down before in the last memory. The lantern. Okay, this is right as the dudes are striking. So they had no idea they were going to get attacked yet. So I think it's almost like they controlled the lightning... As a, and the lightning was a diversion to throw everybody off, or maybe it's just a weird coincidence. So that's to do with the turban. We've got him, Wei Li. Still blur too. Someone's voice sounded kind of like real guttural. 
I don't know if it was coming from up here or from down there. Hmm. I'm interested in Turban Guy, though. Okay, it does look like we could identify him. Hmm. Okay, let's look at it this way. He is one of the top men. We know that. But there's a bunch of dudes from India. Which I think are these guys. But like, they're all sitting, they're all chilling by themselves, so... Is there another Middle Eastern dude not from India chilling over here? That's what I want to know. If maybe he's somebody else. Maybe I wasn't correct and he's not one of the guys from India. But still a top man. So let's go find all the top men dudes again and see. Yeah, there's one from Persia. That could fit the bill. I, d I could have sworn the tag for the sword that was 50-something. Uh, okay. Oh, it, no, those guys want to be China. The other dudes were China. The India was what I was thinking. Okay, yeah. So there's four from China, China. There's four from India. He's all by himself. Sierra Leona. I don't know. I don't know what kind of place Sierra Leona is, to be honest. And now I feel kind of dumb. Um, let me look that up. Uh, let's see. Sierra Leone. Okay, it's African. Hmm. Um. Oh wait, these are seamen. Okay, so that that wouldn't count anyway. That one. Can, okay, so it wouldn't be them. He's not Chinese, so it's got to be this guy. It's got to be that guy. Okay. Uh, yeah. Let's do it. Um, oh, here he is. Cool. All right, let's go. Uh, let's go through our door. Come and walk through our door on our cursed ship. All right. Now what? <laughs> I guess we're going back downstairs. Back down here. Um. Oh yeah, we can do this. Let's see what the cow skull has for us. Oh. Let her hear. One swing. Get true to skull in stone or brain. I'll cut her throat when you've done it. Here? It's very Come Irish. Come on before she kicks off. <laughs> you all right there, sir? But <laughs> never been on a farm, John. Hmm. Find your shoes now. Okay. So, Charlie, they said. Interesting. Hmm. Okay. There's a lot to figure out here. Someone said... Over here, so take him to the carpenters and read him his last rites. Or wrap him up to the carpenters. Yeah, read him his last rites.
You said the guys that I think are the Indian guys. There's some of the Formosian guys. Oh, come on. Let me stay in. Dang it. All right, then. Hmm. Okay. Uh, let's see. Large claws, cow slaughtered for the meat. Ten others were present. We definitely need to go back into that memory and see what all was going on because I think there's quite a bit that we can figure out. So, um, first I wonder if I can see anything through the windows or anything. I'm not sure who the guy with the monkey is just yet. So, not much we can do there. And who is this one again? Okay, one of those guys. The Formosian guys. These are the two guys we haven't been able to identify yet. Hmm. And I don't see anything that makes it look like we're going to be able to just yet. Okay, um, so not much we can do there, not much we can do with him. So I guess really it's going to be everything around here we can, uh, there's quite a bit we can do here, I think. Um, so I was suspecting he's either the cook or the butcher. I really think he's the butcher now, based on what was said. And then somebody called him Charlie. So let's see if there is a Charlie. This is the guy that that burned to death. Uh oh, Charles Minor. Okay, that might be it. No, wait, 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 wait. Did he speak in French? No, none of them spoke. F um. Yeah, I don't. He didn't sound French. Is there a different Charlie? Let's find out here. There is Charles Hirschstick from England. Okay, so I bet that's it. Hey, it looks like it was. All right. Let's see what we got. Let's see who all we can confirm. Okay, so John Davies, the fourth mate we got. Charles Hirschstick. Okay. And who else did we get right? Oh, Omid Ghul. Cool. We still have so much to go, though. Like, look at this. It's like... We're only, like, a quarter of the way there. Goodness gracious, like, how? I don't know how. Because I feel like we've gotten most of the deaths, just not a lot of the identities. This guy, though, sounded Irish, and... We know he's either the cook or the butcher. Butcher's Irish. There we go. Got him. And now I'm starting to wonder. If one of these two could be the cook. Uh, well, definitely not. We've got him identified. Who's this guy? You've seen him a lot before. Okay. We saw him there. He was the one that was hiding when that attack started. He's there with the butcher, so that kind of makes sense. 
Um, okay, let's see if what other memories this guy shows up in. I don't remember him being here. Oh, unless he was the one that died. Okay. But he was in those. It's interesting. He was there during that. Nothing that really indicates to me right now his job. He's up there doing explosion. That leads me to think that he's not who I, that is. Okay, no. I don't think he... Okay, I think this guy's somebody else. All right, yeah, I don't know who this is just yet, then. Not sure, not sure. But I'm sure we'll get there soon. See what else we got. Oh, okay, we're going to see what happened to this guy now. Okay. All right, so don't tell me this guy just died in their hands. Oh, no, he was already dead. Because that one dude was saying something about... One of them was saying something about wrap them up the carpenters. Ooh. Well, same as the other fellow. Some lung disease, not consumption. Made worse by the cold. Will it spread? If so, we'd all have it. They must have huh. picked it up at the Alaska house. I checked all hands just now, and everyone is healthy. And him? <laughs> what are his chances? I gave him some laudanum. We'll see. <laughs> hmm. So it sounds like a doctor's in this room somewhere. So this guy, it sounds like a disease of some kind. Not sure who I was talking, though. Okay, well, that's the one guy, the, uh, third mate. So that, I bet, is the doctor. I wonder who this guy is, then. Oh, gosh, there's a whole bunch of stuff going on out here. These guys are still just chilling. Ooh, I wonder if we can find something out from here. Ah, rats. Hmm. Okay. Rude. Well, whoever the guy is, he died of an illness for sure. Um, so we'll go with that. Okay, we'll exit that, and then let's start looking at... Um... I was hoping we'd be able to see into their thing, but we can't. I still don't know what these guys are all about. Hmm. I think these are the guys from India. I wonder if this is where they sleep, these four guys? So the guys from India maybe sleep here? I don't see any numbers. Or maybe they're just here because that's where the doctor is. I do think that this guy's probably the doctor. Which makes me wonder if this guy might be... an assistant or something of his? Let's see if there is such a thing. So let's take a look. Who is the doctor? The surgeon. 
Wait a minute. Henry Evans. Unknown fate. Why is the name Henry Evans so familiar? Henry Evans. Hmm. I don't know. That stands out to me. I'm not sure why. Oh, you know what? Hang on. Hang on. I think I know. I think I know. Oh, my God. This is going to tell me exactly what's going on. Um, Boom. Right there. Written by Henry Evans. Okay. So did they say where he is? He's the one that sent us here. Um, return the book guaranteed post to the French Office of Affairs in Morocco. Huh. Morocco. So he got away. I think he was on that I think he was on that ship. I think he was on the little boat. Um, what's the... Um, let me find that memory, the escape one. Uh, okay, escape. Let's take a look. Uh, not that, not that. Oh, we saw this guy before. He's definitely a top man, for sure. Um... Okay, these are the unknown fate guys. Yeah, okay, so he's there. They got on that boat. All four of them were on the boat together, but if they survived, that means... Um... They would be alive in uh, Africa. Gotta be. I think. Let's try. Let's just try it for all of them and see what happens. Oh my god, we got it. Oh my god. Okay, so we're right about that guy. Oh, if we can find the, um, if I can remember the memory with the other guy that was next to the butcher, then I can figure out who the cook is, too. Um, okay, that's going to be next, um, early soon. But first, let's get, um, let's add them to the same thing. So, alive in Africa. And alive in Africa. Boom. So then I think maybe this guy... Okay, he's one of the guys that was killed by the beast. Mm, I don't know yet. I've... Oh, there's the monkey. I have a suspicion that he's the surgeon's... Um... Assistant or whatever, but... I'm not sure. I mean, there's a really quick way to find out. You know, if we just... If we just tag him... Because we just added two people that we know are correct. So if we... If we do this, then we know we've got it. There we go. Okay. 
awesome. Heck yeah. Okay. There's that. All right, well, let's find out what's up with this guy. All right, our little spice ghost ain't gonna go very far. It's gonna <laughs> land right there. Come on. There we go. Okay. Oh. That's some Russian. And that's Arabic, I think. Again. Huh. Oh, okay, okay. So he's talking to this guy. Oh, 54. Oh, he's in a, a hammock with this thing on it. Okay, hang on, hang on. Um, okay, I can quickly figure out who he is then. Oh, this is going to help us big time. Um, 54, Solomon Syed. Perfect. We might be able to get quite a few now. Oh, that's just an X. I don't think he's number 10. Who else do we got here? Who are you? Um, okay. That dude, and he's 51. All right. Okay, we'll get him real quick. He won. Um, 53 is out of bed, so he's got to be 53. Crap, come on. Dang it. All right. So it was illness for him, too. Definitely. There's a lot we can do here, though. Okay, so this guy has to be number 53. So... Let's check what 53 is. William Wasim. That leads the other guy has to be that guy. So, him... Back to the 50s. So he has to be Abraham Akbar. Boom. Look at that. How many times have I said boom during this playthrough? Okay, he died to illness. He died to illness. He got crushed. We're almost like halfway there now. Awesome. Now, I heard some folks speaking Russian over here, so I wonder if that's going to help us out. And then some more stuff. 58. 56. 55. And 57. If we can figure some of them out. We'll try that. It was here, 37. Oh, a tattoo of a woman on his arm, 37. Let's see who 37 is. Thirty-seven. Timothy. Butmit, 
from Scotland. The boot mint. Hmm. He's one of the top men. Okay, so I wonder if we get back into that guy's memory or that, that memory with the guy that died up top where we can see all the top men. I wonder if we can figure out who he is. Like if we can see his thing. Okay, 36. And then who else is by him? 42. So I'm guessing the Russians sleep here. So I heard he's definitely a topman. And he's Russian. Because they were speaking Russian. At least I think he was the top man. Wait, who is it? Okay, yeah. This guy was one of the ones that we saw up top before. So if we can find a top man that is from Russia, we got him. Um, top man, top man, top man, top man, Russia, Lenoid, Volkov. Yeah. Okay. So are all three of them out of their bunks? So that would mean you. It seems weird to me that... Okay, so there's 47... Is another person. I don't know if he fits. Oh, I'll take a look. So he's another one of the Russians. He's literally right there. Um. Maybe they all three are Russian. Okay. Let's see who the other Russians are. Both just semen. Okay, we got Aleski, Toporov, and Alarkas Nikishin. 46 and 47, yeah. What did they say in this memory here? Um... Yeah. What was said? Stop your cheating. Worry about yourself. Can we tell? Hmm. Just trying to see what their cards are. Can't tell. Okay, 45, 46, 47. Forty-five. Wonder if they're sitting in order. Maybe forty-five, forty-six, forty-seven. I don't know that I feel good about this one. Hmm. We don't know how he died yet. 
Um, either of them. I think I think I'll wait. Um, we just we know that they're Russian, but that's all we know. So. Okay, we got a lot of feet sticking out here. Like some shoes. Let's see. 41, 40, 39, 38, and 59. Let's take a look at those numbers. I th thinking these are the Chinese guys. 38, 39, 40, 41... See if those are all here. 38, 39, 40, 41. There's a 59 for some reason. There, yeah. Uh, yeah, 38. 39. 40, 40. So they put everyone together by nationality on the ship, it looks like. I wonder who's 59. 59. George Shirley. Well, that guy kind of stands out, huh? They must not have just had room for him. They do have the shoes sticking out pretty prominently, so that's what I'm going to see if I can get a good look at something. This look pretty big. Um, can't really see any of the other folks, but we can see these two dudes. His look. Like they have maybe like a little buckle, and his just look very square. Like his are rounder, his are more square. I don't know if that'll actually work out, but I feel like this is the square dude. I wonder if, if we can see. All of these guys and other memories that might help. I need to, we need to go do the top man thing again, and then I think that'll help us out with a lot of this. If we can pop back into that memory. Oh. So just three deaths for that one. Okay. Let's get up top. And where's the one guy? There he is. Okay. So this dude's got kind of like flippy floppy looking kind of shoes. Do we have him identified? No, we don't. Almost kind of like sandals. This guy's... Okay, we have him identified. His are white with kind of striped socks? Who's this guy?
You know what? I wonder if this is the um, the English dude that is just bunked up with them. I bet he is. Or can we see a tattoo on his arm anywhere? Okay. So white with stripy shoe or stripy socks is the dude who's gambling. And then electrocuted guy there's kind of a flip-flop thing going on okay let's see if we can figure that out hopefully that'll work we'll see I think this is the white with the stripy socks. I... This might be Flippy Flop Man, I'm not sure. Yeah, I think this is the guy that got electrocuted, I think, right here. 38. So, let's take a look at... Okay, so I think he's number 38. Oops. I think so. And Stripey Sock Guy 39. This guy. Believe him to be 39. We'll see what happens. Okay, it worked. <laughs> Didn't find him by the shoes. Great. That's amazing. Okay, we got him correct, too. So we're halfway through this. I wonder if there's another... I was thinking of another memory that we might be able to look some more. There's some other really distinct ones. There's some pretty boxy ones. That's got three dots on it. Um... Or he's just this big blub of a foot. Don't know. 59 is the one with the dots. And I don't think that that is... Yeah, that wasn't one of the Chinese guys. So now I'm thinking... Let's get into the memory of the guy that they strung up for the firing squad and because there was a lot of people present there we'll see if we can find anyone Huck Seng Lao, you have 
been found guilty by self confession of the murder of there we got him we have him yet no okay as captain of this ship and by the authority of the I think his are the real boxy looking ones that we were looking at before if there's anything distinct on them not really some lightness just kind of around this the sides and then dark there oh this is gonna be helpful too because I wanted to figure out who this guy I think that this is the cook. Pretty sure. Okay. We identified this guy. We have, right? Okay, yeah, we just don't know what happened to him. Who else can we figure out? Mm, I think that's about all we're going to figure out there. Um... Yeah, I think he's Mr. Boxy Shoe. Excuse me, hey, hey. Now let's run back down again. And um, hop into this memory again. Okay. It's not that shoe. We know that shoe. 40. Okay, 40, I think. Or... No, it's definitely not 38, so I think it's 40. We might be able to figure out the rest of it, of these folks, through that, so. Um, yeah, I think so. So let's go uh, to the picture. I believe he's number 40. Uh, Li Hong. Yeah. If so, so then, um, I think we got all the Chinese guys. Which means if we're looking at all the top men. He might be a top man too. And he's gotta be. So these two. I gotta figure out these two. Clubbed by Robert Witterell. Okay. I know a way to figure out if he's the one with this mark. Um, which would make him number 37. So he might be able to finish figuring out all the, who all the top men are right here. I think that is going to be him, just because his sleeves would have to be rolled up. And I think the way will be uh, right here. 
If we can find a tattoo somewhere on him. Oh, well, I don't see one. Okay, so maybe that's not him. Hmm. So it can't be him. Interesting. That blows my theory out. Um... So what top men haven't been used yet? Top man, top man. Lewis Walker and Timothy Butter. So he's the one that has the tattoo. We know that. So I wonder if this is Lewis Walker then. And if we go to... The photo or the drawing. The other top man. I'm assuming this is this. What memories is this guy in? Parish and Murder Part 3. Parish and Memory was 14. Which was what? Okay, so he was in. Yeah, he was in that. Um. He died there. Okay. Um, I think he might be our boy. Let's go take a look and see. I think this is... That is... No, that wasn't his body. Um, We might be able to find it from here, though. Let's see. That's our Russian guy. Okay. Um. Well, I thought we would have found him. Oh, no. Never mind. I'm in the wrong. Never mind. I'm in the wrong memory. Okay. I was looking at the wrong body. Okay. I need the one where they were going after... What was it? Miss Lim? Got to that memory. I don't think it was that guy. Hmm. Okay. I'm going to have to figure this out again real quick. Uh... Let's show the memories on the map. The heck are they? Um, I... What? Hmm. 
Was shot with a gun by an unknown attacker. Yeah. Oh, maybe it was over here somewhere. I think it was there. I think it was that one either. It wasn't that. That was Lynn's body. I wonder if this is one that we can't get to anymore. Uh, oh, this is the one we got to from, like, the meat haunch thing. I think. Okay. Uh, where did we find that? Here? Yes. Okay. Okay, that's him. 37. That's the guy. And he was shot by... He was shot by Nichols. So, we should be able to solve this right now. There we go. If only we could... You know what I didn't think of? Um... Okay, who's this guy again? Okay, we don't have enough to identify him yet, it says. Oh, I never even saw this guy. I don't think we saw him. Yeah, we don't have him yet. I think he's one of the Russian guys from what I... Yeah, okay. He was one of the Russians. I believe. What do we got going on on this side? Okay, another one of the Russians. Okay. Looks like they're putting them into, like, these boats, like they're gonna... They're either pulling them back on, or they're going to take them, I'm not sure which. I can't- I don't know if they're lowering them in, or... what they're doing. Hmm. I just wish I could figure out which of these two is which. Okay, what all has he got? He's got a satchel, and he's got a corncob pipe. I feel like I saw that satchel in a memory, and that might be what we need. So, let's go take a look. Um, how do we get out of here? I think this might do it, guys. I think this is going to be it. Okay. Um, we need to pop back into the diseased guy's memory again. This poor guy, we're just using him like crazy. Okay. There was a satchel. Okay, that's what we needed. We've got this. He is 30, uh, 47. Alright, we've got you, bud. This is number 47. Oleski Toporov. And that means that you are the only other Russian. So you, my friend, by process of elimination, Alarkas Nikishin. Nikishin. I don't know. However you say it. 
Okay, so we figured out all the Russians. We figured out all the guys from India. And I think we figured out all the Chinese guys on the ship. Um... We determined... I think all of the top men. That's quite a bit. Let's, uh... I just want to take a look at this manifest real quick and just see. Don't know what happened to these guys yet. This guy we have not figured out. But we we have a we have a an idea of who they might be. Um You know what? I I kind of want to just try him. I kind of want to just try that and see. That would be a nice way to top this episode off. Is if we can get that and then just get some more solid answers and get all of them wrangled in. So I'm trying to remember what was a good... I'm trying to remember a memory in which, like, there's a specific memory. I think it's this one that I think I saw that dude with the guy that I think is why I think they were together. Um, that was not well explained at all, and also this is not the memory. Dang. Okay. Oh, wait. That's the dude. Because there was a specific scene... Because the one guy gets his arm torn off by the beast. And then he asks what happened to the other guy. And I think we can see, like, the moment that was going to happen. That's what I'm trying to find. He's the one that was pulling them back. Hmm. Uh, nope, not this one. Okay, so what could it have been? Maybe it was Abigail's memory. It might have been either... I think it might have been Abigail's memory. Let's go take a peek. Yeah, this is the one. This is the one. This is where he's getting his arm ripped off. And then he asked what happened to my Frenchman. And they said he got torn apart. So I think that's him. So that's who I think. Oh, and it says that we can identify him. So if he's the bosun's mate, that makes him the Frenchman, Charles Minor. And it means that he was torn apart by the Kraken. So if this, if we get this, this will be a great cap off. There we go. There we go. That feels good. Okay. Solidified that one. That's fantastic. And then that one too. All right. Whew. My brain kind of hurts now from all of this. But look, we're over halfway there. So um, that's awesome. All right. Uh, we'll, we'll figure out where to go um, from here because I'm not really sure um, where to search from this point. Um, there must be more downstairs, like in the very bottom decks of the boat that we haven't seen yet. But um, not entirely sure. But yeah, that's what we'll pick up on on the next episode. Thank you so much for watching this. If you did like this, please do the whole like, share, comment, subscribe thing. You know, do all those things. Um, but yeah, hope you did enjoy it. And uh, remember to keep things casual, because uh, if you don't, I'm going to send these big old crab people after you. Okay, bye.